We have more ulti and we got Alex versus Ray. And yeah, surprisingly no stall, that's pretty nice on Ray's side. So the game doesn't take five years and it's a bit more fun to watch. I don't know why the Celestita sprite wasn't there for a second, but there it is finally. Is this his ladder team? Alexander's ladder team? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he used High Dragon Mimic I I don't remember if this is the exact team. Yeah, he doesn't have a Dark Resist though. But I'm pretty sure Toxflex is fine. I thought I think it's Scarf High Dragon. Mm -hmm. I mean, Dark he has a remember. Coco and what else? Yeah. Like Coco can um, take everything that Hydra wants to do, other than like off power, <laughs> and potentially Fire Blast would also do a good chunk. But Draco and Dark Blood would both bounce off. She Dark Blood probably is like 35 ish. Yeah. Earlier when I clicked Hydreigon vs. Um, Celestila, I overestimated Celestila and I thought it was like Specs Hydreigon when it did 50, but it was Scarf. I think in a Black Oblivion game. But yeah, this is, uh, whatchamacallit, a free fake out, um, a lot of ice punches here. Okay, he doesn't have too much for uh, I mean, Medicham. Alex could be like Rocks or Morwell as well. To get rocks up versus stall, but I think it's just rocks land though. I don't know. I haven't like seen him ladder with this team, so I don't know the sets. I think this is Ash. Actually, actually, um, it depends. Think... It depends on the high dragon. Oh, it's Z move. Oh. Okay. Okay. I don't know why he used it there, because the pex was pretty. Yeah, free. The pex was pretty free. Maybe he predicted. I don't know. Toxic spikes only hit like two things on uh, Alexander's team. Yeah, the grin and the Mimikyu. Yeah, so Yuten yeah. should be coming out here from Ray. Unless he has HP yeah. ground, but HP ground on Coco died out. It was a thing early Thunder Moon when people were running Spadev Merrick for Coco and people were running Magnezone a lot for Coco. Oh, and Cartoon started. Yeah, but the Cartoon stall game, yeah. I mean, I can it's click stall. on it. Oh, I haven't seen it. Oh, it's like, it's like stall versus like not stall. <laughs> Yeah, this looks like yeah. Weezer. This looks like Weezer's team, but yeah, I don't think that's that interesting for you guys. We're gonna focus on this series. Yeah, and it's talk like combine, combine crest wins that game. I potentially make like um like a review, just a quick review video about the other series because in game one they also brought stall. So I recorded a few minutes of it, but like I don't want to record like the entire thing. It's a rock score up here. Mm -hmm. Yep, I assume that Alex just goes into the land or... I trade them. And they both don't have... I have Ooh. control, right? Yeah. So this is gonna be a fast game for sure, both have HPIs. So on Ray's team, it's definitely Zemo of Coco. Those HPIs did a lot. Yeah, maybe it's like... Invested? I don't know. In special attack? Yeah, guess so. Maybe one of them is expert, but no idea. Actually, All no, right. the opposing land did more with HPIs, but it was lefties, and this one did less, but it's not. Okay, I'm confused. Mm. <laughs> so, yeah, I think the Serb is just sub seed on this team. Z move is not that good on Serb. Definitely. You just click like, um,. Ice, ice punch. punch. Oh, Zen had butter yeah. HJK. Oh, no, not Zen. Not really a switch in. Not Zen. Because you don't want to risk missing. Ice punch is fine. Um, and after this... How does he even revenge this? Morwell might live a hit with Intimidate, but this Medicham is a huge problem. Oh, Mimikyu. Yeah, he has Mimikyu. He gets, he gets the Draco. I mean, he has oh, a yeah, Mimikyu, Mimikyu, but if that's Fist of Salas Dila, um, Mimikyu just gets walled, kind of. Mm-hmm. Goes, that's gonna die to Ice Punch. Okay, So he definitely didn't want to risk missing and didn't want to reveal anything about his set, I guess. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what did Morai say? Katuma CL might just be the greatest series OLT has ever known. Worst series. Yeah, he's trolling, I guess. So, like, even if he has these here, if this is Fist Life Celestila, plus two Shadow Claw, I assume it is like 38, 40, something like that. Yeah, I could see him as Ding, so it forces the Celestial to attack him and he can go mag. Mm -hmm. Or he could just double the mag right here. Oh, he could also just play rough in case Ray breaks a double. 
Um... Yeah, but that doesn't threaten up. Uh, I can see him actually going Pex, too. It kind of oh, covers yeah. the... Pex, Pex, so wor get Pex works as well. The only problem with that is that... Um, he can still go Magnezone. No, the Pex runs Spadav and it takes a lot from plus two thing. But yeah, Pex is fine yeah. play here, actually. Yeah, I didn't think about that. I could see Alexander double into Mac. I mean, if this is not Scarf High Dragon, I'm actually thinking it is Scarf High Dragon now because where's the speed control? I think control? it was. Yeah, because where's the speed control? If it's not Scarf mm -hmm. High Dragon, the Medichim is going to eventually just destroy everything. After the disguise is yeah. gone and after the. when the Mora is in range. Well, he still has Sneak, so. I mean, yeah, he has Sneak, but like. He, Ray, can, can, Ray, can, mind games, Ray can check this Mewtwo pretty easy. And yeah. Medicham is like harder to check. I guess he also has Sucker Punch and Mowile. Alright, I'm guessing yeah. Alexander is gonna go into Magnezone here. Yeah, double into Magnezone would have covered this in the pack. Steel under packs, that would have been a cool play. So yeah, you can just flamethrower here because in case the zone comes out, that does more damage. And it breaks the disguise anyway. Yeah, true. Um, but if he's Fist of Steel, uh, he might not want to risk the zone coming. But this is like hard. This is like a tough situation for the Ray, because if you predict the zone and you double here and the Mimikyu stays in, you're kind of in a ba really bad position. Yeah, that's why that's why like Ray could not afford to double there. Shadow Cloud is a little bit more than I expected. It's not Life Orb. Is it like? I guess it's Z move. Spooky play? No, he already showed Z move on Grin. No spooky play probably. He's not scared of the. Oh, that's Spadef Boost is annoying. Oh, maybe Threat can't mimic you? Was that revealed yet, the item? You got a Spadef Boost. Does, Le does Leech Seed send you out? Send you out if you get a... Mm, I don't think so. But I'm not 100% sure. Right, but yeah, this has a Spadef Boost now, so it's gonna bounce off. Yeah, this... Okay, the Peros sucks. But he hits... He, he can actually kind of potentially beat this 101. Exactly. I mean, if he didn't get Peros, that was pretty much guaranteed that he'd beat the 101 unless he gets crit. Yeah, he actually does beat it. That's crazy. Yeah, like if you ever get to see that... Let's just get a boost. That's, you can't beat him at zone anymore. <laughs> um, oh, and he also gets the burn. <laughs> but Mawile is still. I can see Alex threat. going into Mawile on a protect here, but he stays in. Okay. Yeah. Protect was. Yeah, she just healed up on it. <laughs> That's crazy, man. Like I have, I have stayed in with Celestia on a Coco when I had his death boost because it literally la laughs at every attack. Wow. Well, okay. Let it go, but Coco kind of wins. Yeah, and I can see him going hydrate on the Coco. He has Pex to check the Mimikyu and Scar like Pex also checks Hydreigon easily. I'm pretty sure if the Mawa ever gets an SC up, it kills everything with Sucker and Thunder Punch. Yeah, but he has a Coco at um that's around seventy something, or like yeah, and the Coco also has Roost, so. It even if it's a wrench from Sucker, there's still a mind game. I assume it has a roost. Yeah. I don't know if he has shown the Coco set yet. I think he only showed U turn. I don't really remember. Could be Sub Serp too. Hey, we just said, as much as I want to watch my team shine in OLT, it's so boring if you're not playing it later. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, really, Cartoon always uses this. Like, it's. I don't think it's that hard to prepare for, right? Like you yeah, there is use some weird shit, so it's kind of weird to prep for. Yeah, he uses weird shit, but like it's still stall. Like if you just bring four wall breakers, like you should be fine, right? You just oh, have yeah, to be maybe. careful that you don't have setup sweeper, so you so you don't get reverse strapped by Ditto. Yeah. I mean, yeah, you obviously have to consider some things, but it's easier to build for an opponent that only uses like variations of stall. Like other people use a lot of different play styles. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I mean, yeah, I think Hoopa like wrecked this guy's team too. I mean, at least, yeah. Hoopa's really, really underrated. Exactly, that's one more of the ones that I would always bring versus people that like Stall. Especially after Ducky yeah. is gone, Bob. Um, so I can definitely see Ray Scarf is bringing Stall in game two as well in this series. Mazaza, yeah. I mean, he's using creative stall, which is good versus stuff he uses versus the more common stall build. That is true, yes, but still. Yeah, but Hooper, Hooper's a ghost type. I'm talking about the ghost type one. Oh, the ghost type one. No, I didn't even... Yeah, I wouldn't... Yeah, it's fine. 
Just like taunt, to... like taunt shadow ball or taunt or sub shadow ball. Like it beats everything. Or a lot of things. Mm, so he sacked his Kogo. Does he move would have killed, right? Let me see. Did he, did he predict like the, the Mimikyu sack and he didn't want to go for Z move? Maybe the Hydreigon sack? No, Hydreigon is like. Yeah, Hydreigon is kind of nice. Stuff down. Hydreigon is nice to keep. But speeds the This is kind of a mind game too. I'm guessing Raze is gonna fake out though. Yeah. Cause he's been doing that like every turn every time. So he goes Mimikyu here and he can like then Ray could go and on the if he goes Mimikyu on a fake out then Ray just goes um Pex. Yeah, but he could double back to Mawile and terrains up and stuff. Mm hmm Yeah, I think Ray's just playing really safe. Does Saka even kill this with the Nar from Sucker Punch? Uh, I think it's close. I really want to call this. More oh, was many. So I got a 62 to 74. If it's adamant, um, yeah, which almost every mode. Yeah, like they all run adamant. Exactly. What am I saying? I'm guessing Metachems is going to click Thunder Punch here, or Ice Punch. If it kills Mawile, I get. I mean, I could see a Thunder Punch though. I mean, if Ray has some tactical EV HP on his Medicham, he's safe, but I don't... Oh, he had Bullet Punch oh. from Medicham to tank uh, for the NZ. <laughs> yeah, that's, I think that's GG unless he flinches everything down. Even though his team is not really weak to the NZ, like, he has Apex and the Steeler. And he has Coco that, like, almost kills the, that kills the NZ after prior chip. He has, uh, also has Superior. Like, he has so many checks for the NZ, so, like, I'm a bit confused by that, that he has Bullet Punch on that, on his team. But he had worked here and... Holy! That's that's, that's not Scarf, right? Okay, then I guess Medicham wins anyway. I mean, if it's Scarf, and that's Fist Death Pack, that must have been like a high roll, but I don't think that's the case. We're gonna call it that real quick. Scarf versus a Toxapex, oh you wall. You're gonna give the packs no Spadev. The Dark Boots are 30 to 36, so yeah, there's no way it's Scarf, even if this is Fist Death Packs. Yeah, there's definitely yeah. Specs. <laughs> so Alexander just didn't have speed control, or was he Scarf Magnet Zone? He could have been Scarf Magnet Zone, but that's still pretty slow. Um, How much did the Flamethrower do to the Magnet Zone? I'm still the Steel mm, I'm checking the run. Are they 28? Yeah, that's AV. Is it AV? Wow. So he has no speed control, he was just going off Ray bringing like a fatter team. I mean he still has like water shrewing on Gren and he has like Shadow Sneak and Disguise which is nice to check stuff. And he has Sucker Punch on Mobile so he just has a lot of priority. Oh my and god. And he gets another flinch but it doesn't really matter. Actually it kind of matters because he can't he can't take high jump kick because there's a Mimikyu in the back. So is, is... is it Adamant Medicham? Oh, I'm not sure. That could be bad. Oh, I think it is. It seems to be. I think he just dark pulses this and then he sneaks twice, right? Mm, yeah, he's adamant medi. Doesn't bullet punch kill the Mimikyu? This guy, this guy is up. Oh, this guy is up, okay. I thought it was down because he was that low, but he never broke it, okay. Yeah. Damn. So they, they, they never run Dragon Pulse anymore, so yeah. So he can fake out the Hydra, but... If fake if if this had scrappy then he would still would fake out into bull bunch so that sucks. Double, no, he's still double, double, double disguise. Yeah, this, yeah, he wins with disguise, but the double flinch was released. Uh, I would be so mad if I was right. <laughs> I mean, I think he won anyway because he just spammed dark balls, right? No, how did he win? Because he just spammed dark balls, and he, he he would eventually flinch it, or the pecs would go for something other than recover. I mean, the packs could go for Toxic or Skull, burn it. And try to put in a range of like two Leaf Storms or something. And then he could have sacked like the Syrup when it, when his packs got too low. Mm. And then he got Regen, so he's uh, healthy again for Mimikyu. Uh, uh, no, I mean, if he burned or uh, Toxic the High Dragon, he could have faked out into Bullet Punch Kill potentially. But yeah, not sure. Yeah, I guess. Okay, where is it? GG. Game 2 started. Oh. <laughs> And yeah, that was the stall that we expected eventually to appear on the screen. Uh, I see like I see like four stall breakers on Alexander's team. Yeah, oh. probably Z move Bulu and Orlando, and Mega Heracross. Taunt Keldeo maybe. Oh yeah, Keld could also be Z though. You never know. It could be Specs as well. 
If he just doesn't care about speed control. Oh, Banta, Banta as well. I know he's a doggy, but like... Uh, if the doggy is not Sash, then he cannot hard switch into the T-turn to reverse it. So like, Ray is really good for stall, but I don't know if he can win this tough matchup. Um, Why did he leave Hera? Maybe he's Guts or he's gonna... I don't know. <laughs> Uh, usually you Maybe always leave with Kel. To, usually you always leave with like, you always Yeah, yeah, with Kel. Mm. Anyway, what is happening in the cartoon game? Okay, it's still going on. Six versus six. Yeah, I'm definitely I'm not watching it. Oof. Does anybody have a lead? Um. Oh, he whist, misses a whist. He stayed regular form to get his um boost. I mean, That's he better. said. He said fuck Pokemon, but I would have done a lot anyway. Yeah, I guess Alexander's plan is to healing Russia back to Rachi later. Yeah, I think it's Gov Rachi. This is actually a big threat with Guts. Uh, he still has a cleft though. I guess Rock Blast doesn't Doesn't do Pex Wallace is if it's in regular, even if it's burned? Depends. Maybe. Oh yeah, Clef walls it as well. What am I saying? Yeah, Clef walls it. Because they run bold. Um. I can't really tell who has a lead because I'm not gonna hover over all the Pokemon. It's literally six versus six, and his up does is only burned. <laughs> One, and two. There's a, there's a T spec up, so this is gonna die now if gets enough hits. So that Mega Sab is already dead. This can still get healing wished, and he's just gonna get overpowered by all the wall breakers. Um, he can go Bulu or oh knock off wall. That's Ooh. so cool. Get rid of the lefties. That's really good for Bulu. Yeah, this game is over. Because Bulu um this struggles to kill. This class. series is over. Um, he can U-turn <laughs> here. I mean, Ray can like protect the scout, but if this has rocks, now the lander should have rocks. Oh, this has rocks. Okay, so it's not scarf. Ooh, I just he should left. This is not scarf. I'm, I'm I messed up. Okay, so maybe it's the scarf. offensive lando or something. Maybe it's scarf killed or scarf lando. Sub. I mean, it makes sense. The the Kelt, the Kelt scarf makes more sense. But was a person like Ray, that likes like fat, that like it was pretty obvious it was gonna stall eventually. Then like Scarf Rachi would have been f fine, I think, because you can potentially tr cripple something with Trick, and you can have you have the healing wish support. But yeah, the defensive still has healing wish support. So yeah, he, if he has Leech Sheet here, this is a wrap, because then he doesn't even then he always breaks the sturdy. Otherwise, um, Ray could um boost and do counter spam. I think just Horn Leech superpowers. Oh, he also has yeah. a sub up. Yeah, this game's over. Whew. I mean, the I clef, like life. The clef can like. Life oh, I was thinking Z. The clef can like beat the, the terrain ends potentially, but like clef is gonna lose its wishes eventually. It can't wall the entire squad forever. Yeah. No, also that's lefties. So I think we're gonna see a counter or whirlwind. Okay, just roost again. So no, I don't think this team has whirlwind. Yeah, usually it doesn't have, but tricking you earlier, I used whirlwind. So the last. What did Ray think was gonna happen, dude? I don't know. Okay. It's gonna horn leech here. Um, he could go to Clef. Because it's not going to do that much now that the terrain is gone. Don't exactly know what he's doing. Guess he's just wasting some. Yeah, Holy has like the exact amount of PP that Roost has. So. And the other move is probably Super Power or. Yeah, Super Power makes more sense. Yeah, versus Ray. Stone Edge makes no sense, I think. Yeah. Ooh, and now Super Power will kill this. Yeah, he could go Clef on the, he could go this turn, but like... I'm guessing he would go Clef here. The game is over I can see Alexander The game is over again. anyway. Yeah. Oh, Wood ah. Hammer! Whew. Yeah, okay, GG. No, but the Skarm walls it, though. The Skarm does not wall it. Oh! That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Especially when he hearts into it. I thought it'd do a KO. I thought it no, didn't do a KO. No, it's plus six Wood Hammer. Why'd he hard into it? <laughs> uh, this is, oh, he's trying to kill it with recoil. That will kill it, right? Oh, oh yeah, that was nice, I guess. But like, he has still has so many wall breakers. Oh, 
I mean, if uh, healing was just the Hera and then the game kinda. The Hera gets an SD. If this is like sub SD. Hmm. Oh no, it's not sub. Hey, he doesn't even have to mega, he's just getting rid of the lefties, okay. I don't know why he's not running uh, Shed Shell, I guess. You, you know why he's running leftovers on this, by the way? One time he got tricked. And yeah, he tricked I his Black that. Sludge, and then another of his monsters got tricked to Black Sludge or something, I forgot. <laughs> That's Bullet Seed, okay. So is he. Now he's still, he's still healthy enough to heal him, wish it. Hmm. If Woodhammer did 42 to Skarm, I'm guessing Hornleech didn't kill? Yeah, Hornleech probably didn't kill. Um, you can yeah, scroll up. Pony just did like, let me see. Pony did like 26 to scam earlier, yeah. Wait, is he willing to sack is he this? Just sacking it? No, he can still switch to healing wish. Uh, okay. Oh, this might, um, oh, this might not even be Mega. Maybe his Lando just wins now. Is he Mega Tita? No, he should be bent, alright. No, it's, it was, I think it's definitely Mega. That's Scarf Tar. Right? I mean, he's gonna sack something. Oh no, Ray, Ray likes Fizz Def on that. Yeah, he's Fizz Def Pax, that did nothing. No, no, Scarfta would do less, even if it was the Def Pax, I think. Scarfta would do like 30 mix or something. Scarfta's weak as Pith. Um, he's trying to burn yeah. this. I mean, this is not as over as I thought it was. <laughs> yeah. Although Rachi does a lot of work. But there's still a Doug Trio there. Yeah, if this was Scarf Rush, he could cripple something, but... Damn, he needs the burn right now. If it's ground him Dougie and he would go into Dougie on a trick, even if this was Scarf Rush, he would also be really bad for Alex. Like. Mm. If he only needs the chance, the game would have been so over, but yeah, he couldn't risk that, like... I'm not sure if he could have... He was prepped for it, but he still couldn't win. That's crazy. I thought he just wins. What the fuck? I thought he had I like... I think Lando can still do it, maybe. I mean, he can still do it, but it's like way closer than I... ...thought. And it's also funny that he's not getting fire bunch burns. I think it's 20%. I mean, it's not super high chance, but it's like a decent chance. Now, why did you hammer is what they're saying. I mean... If he... If he horn leached... Wait, it was was it the yeah? I guess Holland would have been safe, but the game would have taken longer. He tried to just win it right there. I mean, he gets a, he gets a second chance in, in game three. If Ray wins, we're gonna see game three. What is he doing? Is he gonna edge now? Earthquake maybe. But even if he has just earthquake, the heal, this, yeah, I mean he can. Now he would have to double. Would have to double into Kaleo here. Uh, Elfquick first and then double. But then he takes so many hazards. Yeah, this is really annoying then. I don't know. I mean, Scum is at 11 after rocks. It's so, like it doesn't really. I hope the Lando's Earth Plate or something. Yeah. Because Adam and Earth Plate like, destroys Clef because he doesn't have I mean, He never anymore. went for Zemo with Bulo, so it's either Zemo with Lando or Zemo with Kaleo, right? Yeah. If it's Zemo with Kaleo, that's... the Pax is still a bit annoying. That I think Alexander's just trying to put in range of uh, EQ from Lando, because doesn't EQ not kill at full? Off plate? No, oh, this is Fist Death. Yeah, Fist Death doesn't die. Mm. Oh, well. Doesn't matter, though. Mm, doesn't matter much. Not really. Unless he crits, maybe. This is like 60, right? Ah, oh, shit. Not did nothing. Crit fishing here. Um. Hmm. If the T-Spec wasn't up, Keldeo maybe could do it. Let me see how else is the Clef. Yeah, Keldeo could definitely do it with its Taunt Calm Mind. Like, it could beat the Pex, and then if the T-Spec wasn't up. Yeah, it doesn't beat the Pex though now, because yeah. of the T-Spec. Wait, Alex has no Hazard Control. Hmm. Oh, wait. Yeah, the Clef is dead. The Lando just wins, Lando right? Lando can still do it though, yeah. Uh, if he gets the burn here, uh, Ray can win. Yeah, Ray can win by switching and getting getting Rage and back. He what? scarfs. Oh, he if he oh if he scarf he didn't earthquake because he didn't want to let the scum heal I guess. Huh. So it's looking kind of over. 
Looking like Rage just wins. He's just gonna, yeah, he recovers spam. He never misplays. Like he's like he's not gonna let. He's not gonna let the. I think it comes down to a fifty, right? Cal to it kill. I mean, earthquake doesn't kill, so Ray can just recover, right? Or like scald. Or it comes down to two fifty fifties, maybe. I mean, maybe Alex just has to earthquake crit this, but I don't know that, that even kills because if he's just scarf, it's probably not even gonna kill. Hmm. Yeah, I guess it could be electric for rain, maybe. Should be electric for Gyarados. Yeah, even though Gyarados is not common anymore. Yeah, it's also for the thing. Pelipper, yeah. HP psychic. Heck. Now the only hand power that they run sometimes is for um. Bulo the HP poison, but that's mostly on Scarfkel, I think. Yeah. And it definitely doesn't do super effective damage to pick, so it's obviously not there. Yeah, I was about to say, yeah. I, think, I was about to say, I think he's gonna U-turn here, but like, Ray doesn't lose anything from just recovering. Yeah, because he lives, and now like, Keldeo dies to hazards. Yeah, this game plus goes. poison. Okay, so we're gonna see a game three. Now he can just freely go into Lando. I mean, into Skarm here. We can just recover. Actually, you know? no, he shouldn't. He should. He shouldn't. Yeah, he shouldn't. You can just sack Dog too. Um, that works. Yeah, that was fine. And now he gets to heal the Skarm. Kel dies to poison, and it's over because Lando can't kill this at all. Mm hmm. Yo, in the other game it's only turn 68, what the fuck? Why are they playing so slow? So we're gonna see a game 3 between Ray and Alex and what happened here. They're playing slow, they're turn 71. And in that time the other series had, has played 2 games, what? But yeah, Cartoon is up 1-0 in this. I, at first, wanted to like do an extra video for this series, but I kind of lost motivation when I see this, and it keeps going on being the protect of with sub toxic disco. <laughs> Weezer had some wild stall teams. He has one team, Alkal Fable, with uh, Calm Mind, Soft Boil, Defense Curl, and Stall Power. <laughs> it's funny. When the opponent lets oh, you no. set up, you can beat packs with it. <laughs> That's what I did yesterday on ladder one time. Does anybody have like a lead, do you think? Oh, I gotta look at the health. Wait, the, the crest is dead. Um, mm, that's not this good. this Glisco just doesn't do much because he just switches between. Yeah, exactly. Um, I thought Pax also walls is because Earthquake doesn't do much, but the Alex game started, so I don't really care about yeah, the other. Okay, stall again. <laughs> And oh, no. Alex brought the same team that he brought in game one. Uh, maybe he changed upset. I don't know. Oh, thank God someone said mod jet. <laughs> Lobby is wild enough on smart on smart tours. Knock off Lando would be good in this matchup. Mm, wasn't. What was he in game one? He was not Scarf Land, he was Scarf Dr He was Specs Dragon, he was um, Defensive Land with HPIs, I think, yeah. Um, this looks tough for Ray because um, this this mon called Dougie traps Morwell, otherwise Morwell would put in the work. Oh, you mean it looks tough for Alexander? Yeah, for Alexander. <laughs> yeah. I mean, uh, the Z Water Keldios, I mean, the Z Water. Uh Greninja's pretty good. But he has a chance. I mean, yeah, he can get up hazards, but that's if he plays it correct, yeah. Um, So I'm guessing that the uh, Tex or Scum comes out, yeah. I'm pretty sure Doug, Doug doesn't even kill this at full, because it's Sash. No, Doug only kills with Ground Z, but it's not Ground Z, probably, yeah. Does T Punch kill this one? No. What? He's slower. Oh, he gets up the rocks. Oh, that's, see, that's what I was asking game one if he is um, rocks on this. This actually really looks like an NJMP team, I just realized this, or like a sample team. That, But it, had, it didn't have a Hydra, it had like different mons. But like the structure of the team is like the same, it also had rocks more and AV Magnezone. 
Oh yeah, that's why the Lando didn't get out of rocks last game. Mm, so I think I think I think this has knockoff. Knock I think this has knockoff. Yes, because I remember the team. Yep. Um, it was it was definitely knockoff to get rid of Shejo for zone. This that that sample team that I was thinking about like a few months ago it was a sample team. I don't know if it is anymore. But where's the ground or is this, buddy? Uh, you can U turn on the scarm here, or you can knock again breaking the scarm. Yeah, but if he goes back to scarm, he just knock again. Yeah, off quick is free. I mean, if he's fizz def, or if he's mixed def saber, that probably takes two. But the always risk getting crit because yeah. you can spam off quick. Like that's risky. The cartoon series, yeah. It's not too much progress there. It's disgusting. Game. And also, no people don't like it when I skip between games, so I'm gonna um, avoid it for, uh, for now. I, I only switched like over two times. <laughs> What's that? What the fuck? Oh, you dog, okay. <laughs> I paused my check. Okay, that was. Oh, I hope I didn't kill. I hope we didn't kill any ears from headphone users. The dog was going wild in the back, I think. His dog. Um, but yeah, of course, pretty free, right? So he goes back in the scarm, yeah. Um, so is he gonna go back to packs now on the knock? So he let the Skarmory get knocked, okay, so... If he ever gets the, um... If he traps the Skarmory with the Magnet Zone... Then he can get up, um, rocks with Morwell later and that's gonna be scary. Because that breaks the uh, sash on the Dougie as well, and the rocks are really nice in general versus stall. And the well played Granny can also get up spikes, like I said earlier. Um, yeah, the other. Can I D here, right? Actually, now the Dougie still has the sash intact. But the Ray is not gonna go hard, Dougie, that's no play. I mean, hard Dougie would cover the SD and the Thunder Punch play. But there are the rocks. If he burns this, that actually sucks. Yeah, that would have been really, really bad for uh, Alex if he got burned there. The game might just end if he gets burned here, but he doesn't get burned. Mm. Scarmory has been faster, right? It was faster than this mobile. So I can see SD from Alex here. On the roost. Still like surprised about game two. I thought Alex had that one like a few times. Okay, he goes zone now, and yeah, Ray gets the default, but he can just volt switch here. So Alex got that play correct. Yeah, that actually was a fun play. I don't know why I didn't think about that, but like just vaulting out there is really nice, so you avoid getting trapped from Dougie there. Now the rocks are gone, but he can get them up again. Um, Ray might try later in the game to like bring Sabre and rocks, but it's gonna it's not gonna work out that well. Because it's a Mawa, so like, <laughs> even if he goes Sableye, the rocks eventually will go up because Sableye won't stay on a Mawa unless he's gonna like sack it to player off. And if he sacks it to player off, the rocks go up after anyway. Alright, I'm back. Okay, so it's looking nice for Alex. <laughs> Got rid of the Skarm. Ooh, the Skarm died. Wait, yeah, let me go back. He knocked it off and then on the default, he got his um, Magnezone in and vaulted out. So he. I'm getting this U turn here into like Hydra or Magnezone. Probably Hydra and then U-turn if he has that. I don't know if Specs runs U-turn. Like he's gonna Wisp or Knock, uh, but Wisp is like more likely. So Protect, get some Burn Chip. And also in case Alex double Protect was nice there. The chance he goes at it 50, <laughs> nice chip. <laughs> Let me actually upload the uh, game 2 between um, Comp and Black Oblivion real quick. Okay, we didn't miss any turns. Um, so chance he might get the rocks here. Hmm. So um, now, if, if he ever gets rocks up again, the Dougie sash is broken, so he can sucker punch it. Yeah, but 
Is it Sub Dougie on the scene? I just disconnect, let me reconnect. So he went into Lando. I'm reconnecting. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're back and what is this? He said he went for Tide Me Toss. He's, he doesn't want to lose his Defy Light, obviously. And he cannot go into Sable and Earthquake. This is really like scary for Ray. Like if he stays in a knockoff, that's really bad. And if he switches on an Earthquake, I think he's just gonna go Clef, right? Yeah, Clef doesn't like it either though. Clef doesn't like it, but... It's better. He wants to keep the Violet on Shenzi still. More than the uh, lefties on Clef. Yeah. I mean, if he goes Sable on a knockoff, then he could probably live an Earthquake after, but that's too risky. I mean, maybe, yeah, I can see him making that play. He has to play... Sable is at what? 77. That might be able to live. Although they run Max Pudef, right? Mm. Some people run Max Pudef so they can eat up Moonblast from like Clefable and recover spam. And the spread that was used like a few months ago, I think it was like 140th Pudef or something. But it depends on the team. Like sometimes if you're weak to Medicham, they run more free stuff. But yeah, this team also has like a cleft jacket and a doggy, so it's, it doesn't really need free stuff. I could see if the Mawa ever comes in again, like him going hard dug on the rocks or something. Yeah, if he had... Yeah, that's for sure. I could also see him trying to predict the Mawa double and go doggy on a double one turn, but like, I don't know, that's so yeah. tough. Like, I mean, especially this turn, he can't go doggy because... The Lando could just U-turn. Mm -hmm. um, if Alex had healing wish, this would be pretty nice for him in this match. Wait. What the fuck? Isn't the game just over now? He's trying to lose to Mawile, dude. This is like a free earthquake. Yeah. What is he doing? I mean... Like, he can kill the Lando, but, like, does it matter? It doesn't matter. Like, after he just goes Gren or something. Does a reversal kill this from here? I don't think so, if it's Max Dev Lando, or, like, Bulky Lando, at least. Um, I want to see a hard Mimikyu. I mean, knockoff Lando plus Magnuson is really scary in general for the stall team. Some if someone uses the stall team on ladder, they would probably be mad and be like, "C team, you scumbag!" <laughs> <laughs> Goat. I have, I called that play, didn't I? Oh, I see. Yeah, nice. Mm. I mean, Pex is coming in here for sure. Pex or Clive both work because, like, can he can he just go back into Lando? Mm, he can also. He can't go back. It's um arena trap broken ability. Uh, he's ghost type though. He can probably. Oh yeah, I he's ghost he type. Do. Yeah, he can go back. I'm bad. I forgot. <laughs> Mickey is so bad, dude. <sighs> I mean, it's bad in this matchup versus offense. It's good. Yeah. So that's gonna do zero. Oh my god. Yeah, it's not life orbs. It bounces off even more. Like sometimes on the low ladder, if you're toxic and mimic you. They would just keep yeah. SDing to plus 6 and then try to attack you Clefable and then or just like 20, what the fuck, then they don't get it. It's unaware. <laughs> but yeah, um, I can see Red trying to go on the Sableye, but even if he gets that play correct, he's still kind of in a bad position anyway. Yeah, I can see Alexander just play roughing. Okay, yeah, I mean if you rock there, he could have spent Sucker as well. Unless the Dougie also has Sucker and outplayed every single Sucker. Yeah. Yeah, I hope that as well what Miro said. I hope this isn't the preview to race snake teams. So yeah, that did so fucking much. He doesn't so care if his mom gets to burned pray now. for the burn and he this moment is well trained. He had scored it three, he yeah. called it he scored it three times and he never got burned. <laughs> yeah yeah, so Red Alex should win this for sure and Dennis is gonna be happy because one of his Italian guy uh one telling guy one. It's not over yet though. I mean if he misses a player that would be annoying. I think he's gonna switch and keep this for Sab. Uh 
uh, he can go man his own here. Does this live a moon blast? Yeah, this lives a moon blast, so. I mean, player of risk. Yeah, like he risked the myth. I don't know if I like that. Like, I feel like he had a guaranteed win. T punch might kill from here. Probably should. Probably kills. I don't know if they protect though. I definitely think he would protect. Now ICT, I stealth rock here. Oh, he did it, but ICT set. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he just wins with earthquake. So. No ghost. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he had it already clicked though. Watch this cliff somehow miraculously live this. Yeah. Clef um, dies and then just Mimikyu can... Isn't this the fans of Lando? This might live. No, it's, it's not rocks. I think it's yeah. just like offensive with HP ice. Oh, I thought... Maybe he changed the set. I thought that the team that I had in mind... There was defensive with knockoff off Q turn and HP ice and just didn't have rocks. Yeah, I don't think it's defensive. He took like 80 from defensive Lando HP ice the first game, so. Yeah, I remember that he took a lot, but. So I don't think he has any HP. So do you think Jolly or Adam makes it sick? Jolly. Uh, maybe Min Mineral is kind of live, especially if his bolt makes death. But yeah, Ray can't switch out because rocks are. I guess out. he's gonna go for like a double protect here. Yeah. If he lives, he's gonna be so pissed, but yeah, he doesn't live. Mm -hmm. Um, so he's gonna recover here. Can chance he still do it, that's the question. Oh, that does a fuck ton, never mind. I was I was about to say he's gonna recover here. It was off-played, okay. I didn't know it was off-played. That's why I thought he could eat it. Hmm. Uh, I don't think chance he can... What? He's gonna Shadow Claw here, right? He doesn't wanna risk the myth. And this ties to rocks. Yeah, Chansey can actually still do it with Toxic and Player of Dodges. Just crazy. So he's gonna spam Soft Bolt here. I think if he hits two, he wins. He can even get up his rocks, uh, but he's probably gonna spam Soft Bolt. He doesn't really need the rocks. Yeah, he can get up rocks, he can get rocks up here because he's getting to plus six. Yeah. But like, he I mean, doesn't need now rocks, all so Soft Bolt spam yeah. is fine. Bro, I'm scared. I'm scared now. Oh god. Okay, uh, that did a lot, much. but he can still miss. He, he can afford like two misses. Yeah. Alright. GG. Okay, Alex. Ah, pulled, let's go, dude. Alex pulled through with his Wraith stall team. The second time at least, the first time it didn't work, but he has a best of three. And Wraith's gonna be a bit annoyed because of that um, game, one, game one where he got double flinched. I don't know if that mm -hmm. mattered though. I think it Wait, was that game one. Yeah, that was game one. Yeah, game one he got flinched. I think that definitely um, played a role in the game. Yeah, it's hard to say because see, dude, like Alex, like never misplays. Well, not like seriously bad. Yeah, like if maybe you that cares. game two was a little iffy with the horn leash and woodhammer things, but yeah, I mean if he cares about it, then he wins. Like I think there was like one two where he didn't care about it, and then he lost, but yeah. Yeah. Um, so is there even a series left? Uh, no, I don't think so, right? I think the cartoon is only the left. So we're gonna, let me pause, yeah. we can go to OG thread. Now, actually, let me do this. So I checked the forums and this is the last series going on is the, and the insert also checked it and knew that the CL series is the last going on. So I thank you for watching, I might record some of the other series. And yeah, congrats to Alex for the win, and he's in winner's bracket now if I didn't... If I know how this tool works, yeah, that sentence made no sense. And goodbye. <laughs> mm -hmm.